36,000 customers across the state are without power this morning. As we've been saying, this wet, heavy snow also causing problems for the power grid. It's weighing down power lines and also taking down tree branches. So again, just uh, give yourself some extra time with the conditions. Yeah, and if you are headed out to work this morning, you're still going to be finding some of that slush and some of the yes. slick spots. I know we found them on our way in. Mm -hmm. Lauren Coomer out live right near uh, 196 in Grand Rapids this morning. Lauren, what are you seeing right now? Yeah, good morning to you both. Hey, roadways seem um, pretty normal in terms of traffic this morning, which is quite surprising due to the amount of snow we got. This is the uh, first big snow of the season. So a lot of people are getting used to uh, being out here and driving in that. Now, what we're seeing this morning is nearly half a foot of snow here. Um, as you can see on the fence, the accumulation of what we're getting, and that is what has been um, being seen on the roadways too. The main roads, we are here along 196. Pretty clear, um, of course, wet. Now there is some slick spots that people will need to be aware of this morning just because of those temperatures. But when it comes to um, more quiet roads like these, for example, here in this neighborhood, uh, they that you are seeing that accumulation of that thick, wet, heavy snow, and that is what is causing those slick spots and areas. So people who are heading out this morning, heading to work, heading to where they need to get to, will need to take it slow. Make sure you leave time um, in between you, or leave time to get to your destination and leave space in between yourself and some of those other vehicles to make sure you arrive to your destinations. Now, crews have been out here working all morning long to keep those roads clear for you, those sidewalks clear as you get out to where you need to be this morning. So make sure to leave them room as well. Um, if you just look down here, though, to where I'm standing, this is an example of what you're seeing because we have this thick accumulation of snow, but then the more I've been standing on it, it's creating those slick spots, which is exactly what is happening on the roadways as cars continue to drive out. So make sure you just take it slow and be careful this morning. We will continue to bring you updates all morning long as the snow continues to fall. We'll send it back to you in the studio, though, for now. Reporting live in Grand Rapids, I'm Lauren Coomer, Fox 17 News.